So what's good, y'all? It's Shabar Nabari, man. I'm back again with another video. Told you guys I was thinking about getting a new helmet, and I finally got one, man. Check this out. I got a new helmet in from SportsUnlimitedInc.com, and I'm gonna show you guys the new helmet I got. So the helmet I was using before was the Shud RXP. Our season started in June and it ended in December. So it was good for the first couple of months. And then once it got to December, like my head started to hurt. Like I started like when I was getting hit, I would actually feel it. And I put I put air in it. But it was more to like this side up here. Damn. <laughs> Alright. It was like more to right here. In this area right here. So when I would lower my shoulder on somebody, I would feel the hit like right here. And that shit was irritating me. And there's no way to put more air in it. Like you could see, I put air in it a lot on the top and in the back. But right up here in the front, nah. So, uh-uh. I mean, it's a decent helmet, man, when you first get it. If you guys know how to um, fix that, you guys let me know in the comment section. Because I really do love this helmet. I love the RXP. I love the, I love the face mask. The eye shield look dope in it. The visor look dope in it. Show you guys. This is how it was looking. And I love this look. Like, it's legit. So I love this look. So we're about to open this box and I'm going to show you guys which helmet I upgraded to. So this is the new helmet, man. The Revo Riddell Speed. So I upgraded to the Riddell Revo Speed helmet. I have teammates that actually wear this helmet and they both recommended it because I told them the issue and they was like, yo, try this out. And I see a lot of people going with this. So let's see, try it on. You can see the padding inside of it. It looks pretty good. Damn, the shadows. Mm -mm. So the padding is pretty good. Even the ones right here, they're really thick. I just noticed that right now. Try to slow it down. <laughs> this face mask is so ugly. So I upgraded it. Right here is the face mask that I got. So, I upgraded to this one. I don't know if you can see the difference, but... LaShawn McCoy and a lot of players wear this face mask. So, I'm going to put it on my helmet so you guys can see the difference. After a damn 30 minutes of struggling to put that face mask on and all of that, I'm still struggling to put the face mask on. So, one thing about getting the Riddell Revo Speed is that on the sides, it's not like a regular one. I don't know if y'all could tell, you guys gotta push this down and then it has to click inside. Like, let me see, show you guys this. So it's right here, it has to click and go through. I got one side to go in. Let me see if we'll focus on that. Let me focus on this. See, it's in on that. On this side, it does not wanna go through and it keeps popping out, so. I don't know what to say about that, man. I'm gonna have to keep messing with it, but. So far, this is what it's looking like. Oh, you, you just heard it, it just popped out. Hold on. This is the part that goes inside of the helmet, right? And this is the other part. You gotta connect this one on the side and it has to go in and you have to push this button down so it can lock through. This helmet, I like it, it's comfortable. I don't think I'm gonna keep the visor on there. Shock said they're gonna upgrade their visors cause this one, I was struggling to put this one into and I don't think I'm gonna keep it in there, but. It's so, on. Ooh, man. This is comfortable. See, the thing is, too, when I do this, I don't feel a thing. But, on my Air XP, if I do this, That shit hurt. So, uh, I'm gonna rock with the Riddell Speed. I love it, it's comfortable from the inside. Um, 
I bought a pump for it too to add more air. Right now, I don't need no air in it right now. It's comfortable as it is. Um, they gave me a soft, I don't like these type of chin straps. I don't like them. Just in case you get hit, you know, that shit gonna hurt. So I, I bought this separately on Amazon. I got a Riddell, one of the hard cup ones. See, I feel like it'll fit more better. But I like this, the protection is good. From what I feel right now, just by doing this, um, I felt the difference. I, I'm about to struggle to put these in, but um, that's the video, you guys. Like, share, comment, and subscribe, man. You guys, let me know what helmets you use. If you're in high school, youth, or semi-pro, you guys, let me know what helmets you use or what helmets you recommend. See you guys later. Alright, so I lied. Uh, <laughs> I do like these. I do like these clips on the side. They're called Quick Release or whatever, something like that. I couldn't get it on earlier, but all I had to do was do a little modification or whatever, and it worked. So, this is how it is. It's how I look now. I got my Riddell chin strap on it. Got my red mouthpiece. I decided to go red instead of white. This is how it's going to be looking. Uh, I might put an Oakley one on. I don't know if I'm going to keep this visor on. And I got to get new decals, man. Uh, I'm not going to take these ones off. Cause my team is the Thundercats, so I'm gonna need to get one to put it on here. Oh, um, I have an All Star game coming up too, so that's why I wanted to get a new helmet. That's why I got one so fast. Um, cause I have an All Star game in a few weeks, so I wanted to rock this, test it out. Cause if anything, I'm gonna be using this for next season. So yeah. <laughs> All right, so I recommend this helmet. You guys go check it out, man. The link will be in the description to the website that I ordered this off of, man. SportsUnlimitedInc.com. You guys go check it out. They're not paying me for this, but I'm just, just letting you know where I got my stuff from, man. <laughs> See y'all later.